Hey, it's Wolfie Chan, and I am back with another manga review. And this manga is Cutie and the Beast. It's another new manga that I got my hands on, and I, ooh, I love it. Ladies and gentlemen, this is adorable. Our adventure starts off with Makoto, or Mom Momoko. Momoko, sorry. Her name is Mer. <laughs> She's an adorable girl who is an insatiable love, not for the dead, but for TV wrestling. So, WWE, Raw, SmackDown, all that good stuff. That is what she's into, and she's into it hard because she has a favorite person, Koga, or Kuga. I believe it's Kuga. That is her favorite person. So, whenever her friends, and she's in high school, by the way, it says she's 18, which is, thank you. Thank you, manga, so that she can be in, like, a relationship with somebody who's 26 years old. He's 26, though. But, she goes to school, 18, senior in high school, and her friends are like, oh my goodness, I love this guy, and it's a beauty guy, and, you know, this guy who's modeling for this or that, or... It's a thin, slender model, and she's just like, I like muscular wrestling people. Your tastes are so weird, like, you... Come here. You're weird. I don't like that. <laughs> and, of course, all her friends are like, that's just, that's just, no. And she herself has a sister back home, and she will watch any of the wrestling things, any of the fighting stuff. That is what she watches, and it is a and of course she finds out that he has I believe it's a Twitter thing it starts out it's a Twitter account or something and she starts talking with him on Twitter and she's like freaking out like oh my goodness my favorite wrestler is all like this and Kuga is doing a send me letters and all this good stuff kind of a thing. And so with the person he's replying to to Twitter, because he doesn't know if it's a he or she, one of his wrestling people are like, so uh, you, you're gonna ask this girl for a picture in one of your letter things? He's like, whoa, whoa, that's, that's a little much. I mean, I was just talking to her and all that good stuff. Well, I mean, talk to her a lot so you know why don't you why don't you ask for a picture and of course he asks her and all that good stuff I believe it was accidentally sent to her and so she's like okay I guess I'm doing this so she sends the letter sends it with a picture then she's she actually goes in person to one of his wrestling meets and gets to meet him and all that's or at least watches doesn't know if she can actually meet him all this good stuff and you know they meet and all this good stuff and it's so cute when they meet because he's like six foot something and she's like my height and she's so cute and she gets to see her hero and she likes it and it's adorable and then he hugs her and i believe he gets her phone number or something Oh no, he kisses. He gives her a kiss. And she's like, oh my goodness. And it's it's just, it's so cute. And I believe phone numbers are changed. Or like exchanged. So she meets him again, sees if like, you kiss me on the cheek, does that mean something? Yada yada. And of course, he kind of needs an answer. Oh yeah, he ends up following her on Twitter. It's adorable. Oh, and that's how they talk, and that's when she gets his phone number and his door. And so they start talking, all this good stuff. Well, she admits she's 18, you know. I'm going to graduate, you know, in a couple months, yada yada. He's 26. It's a little bit of an age gap. A really big one, to be fair. Um, and so he asks one of his wrestling buddies, like... Because he mentions, the dude mentions, like, hey, dude. Doctor, you know, 
you think you have a big thing for this girl and he's like yeah I did I, I got to meet her I got to talk with her I got to do all this stuff I have a question for you uh so how young is too young to be dating not like that he's like yeah the girl's 18 mm -hmm. guys like yo you need to stop talking to her because like your reputation could just no and of course then he distance himself she gets really sad it's not okay to you know be dating someone who's 18 they get all sad and then you know he sends her tickets because he has an epiphany or something and you know is like come here's tickets you know come see me and they see each other and he's like I want the time to be with you. I want to date you, and and in the future, uh, because you like me. Because nobody ever, nobody would want to date me. Nobody actually, not a lot of girls talk to him. That's the whole thing. Is no girls talk to the muscular boy. Really? This this that hunk of man meat doesn't get talked about. Okay, whatever. You know, people are weird. I don't know, but. He really wants to be with Momoka. And so he asks, like, let's date for a very long time or some odd, and then let me marry you. I believe it's actually, like, what the thing is? Yeah. It's so cute because it's raining and everything. And it's like, so let's get married someday. Someday? Some boy. Yeah, I'm cute. He's like, I'm being serious and I had to think and she says yes and all the cutenesses and then dad and mom are there at the shrine where it's all happening. Like, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. It is it is so cute and it's so awesome and it's adorable. Mm, it's so so adorable. I love this with a passion. I don't think that she- I wanted her to be like 20 or something so it wouldn't be terrible but I still like this manga for how cute it is and how wholesome it is. Like they don't kiss on the lips, they kiss on the cheek. They hug a little bit. It's so awkward. It's so awkward. It's cute. It is a cute story with cute characters and all the cute 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 added to it. I love it, and that's why they're cute. They're cute again. Oh, I don't know. Wait. <clears throat> but I definitely like this. This is more of a romance, guys, so I'm sorry if you were wanting something not romantic. But this is definitely adorable, and I recommend it, even though I don't fully like. Like, I know, 18 in America, legal. But, like, when you get 26, it's a little weird. But okay, you know, she's legal, they want to be together. Okay, okay, okay. So, I do like this story. I do like some of the stuff. The premise is a little weird. But I'm definitely gonna keep reading this. I wanted to find the next volume the other weekend. Forgot that this was in an actual bookstore and not like my local bookstore. So, this will definitely, I'm gonna continue this. This is great. So, if you like the video, definitely like, leave it in the comment section below, cutie, if you got this far. And so I know who reached the end of the video. And definitely, don't forget to subscribe, you, yes you, person watching this who are not subscribed. I know that you're not subscribed. Why? Because I can see in my statistics that you're not. Why not? Like, you watched, you watched to the end, and I'm proud of you. Come on. Just subscribe. There might be something cool in the future. You never know. Do it. <laughs> and if you want to follow me on Twitter or Facebook, the links are down below. Hope that you've been having a good day. Wolfie Chan out. Bye.